Hello. Um, I've had quite a lot of success with uh, the reaction I did to a big train sketch called Hot Cakes and um, it's ironic in a way because it is in a way selling like hot cakes um, and then I had this amazing brainwave um, it only took me about six months nah four months to realize but I thought why don't I post another big train sketch and maybe people will want to watch that as well what a big brain I've got right so this is uh, big train another sketch and uh, let's um, dive right uh, in and that's what's so marvellous about this proposal. Um, I do believe, Minister, that the Eagle Line super train will revolutionise train travel in the new century. Um, London to Edinburgh in super fast time. Well, that's great if it can get from London to Edinburgh as fast as that. I mean, what is it? It's just a fraction of a second. <laughs> No, the, well, the actual train wouldn't be quite as fast as that. I think going from London to Edinburgh is about three and a half hours. Right, yes, of course. Sorry, I should say, that train there, though, there's no way we could give you the franchise if your trains were going to be that small. <laughs> no, that's a, this is a model of, of, of the train. This, the actual train would be... Um, but would well be the size of a normal train. Of course, yes, of course. The actual train will be bigger. And if it's bigger, then it can get from here to here much quicker because that really isn't such a big distance, is it? <laughs> no. <laughs> Sorry, I see I see no, this this isn't Britain. This is a map of Britain. And uh, Britain's a lot is bigger than this. Yes, obviously. These are all obviously smaller versions of everything, but then doesn't that stand to reason that... This may sound like a stupid question. No, please. Well, if the trains are going to be bigger and the country is bigger, then won't we need a... a giant <laughs> to push the train? Yes, that's silly, isn't it? The, the trains aren't... they're not pushed by people. They're powered. Yes, 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 I've got it now. Don't know what I was thinking. Ah! Oops, sorry, are you all yeah, right? I just for a second, I thought I might be... might be a giant, but I'm not, I'm not, I'm not a giant. No, yes, there are no giants. That's what makes this college as great an institution as it is today. So now all that remains is for me to hand over the cheque for £10,000 to the man who's made it all possible and done so much work, Mr Peter Newsgarden. Great, uh, I can't say much really, except uh, that that's very funny. Um, so clearly it, it sort of works on two levels. Uh, first of all, it's just a surreal sketch about someone who doesn't understand scale. Uh, but also I think if you look a bit deeper, obviously it's about um, the, the struggle that I'm sure some civil servants have trying to communicate with uh, politicians who have no idea what they're talking about uh, but because they're stupid. Um, I'm not saying all politicians are stupid, of course, uh, but uh, most of them are. Uh, in fact, all of them are. Um, but uh, yeah, very funny. And um, I'll do some more because I could just binge watch these sketches over and over again for hours on end. Uh, I've seen all of them many times. Uh, so uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed that. Just a quick one, as they say, and uh, don't nobody go nowhere. That's not Anne Robinson, is it? Jesus Christ. Finally, the children's 
She's even got new tits. Tits, 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 tits.